because I remember that was such a thing. Like we used to just open within the middle of a conversation. Yeah. So I'm I'm sitting down to use the bathroom. I, not number one, by the way. I don't care. And uh, <laughs> I was like, how are we going to even start this? Because you were so particular. What was I so particular about? About how it started. Oh, I just wanted some maybe enthusiasm or something. Is that what the problem was? I don't know. I don't remember that I had a problem. I didn't know I didn't like that about you. I didn't know. I feel like uh, we'll find out a lot of the things that probably that we uh, I've forgotten over the years. I always wondered, like, what would it be like if my parents tried to get back together after the divorce? Yeah, but that would be weird, wouldn't it? <laughs> this is the co-parenting podcast. Co-parenting. Okay, all right. Are you the kid, Phil? I think I might be the problem. Dude, that all. actually, and we're always yelling at him because he said that we, he like said something about us and I still What'd lashed out say? at him. He said, said it took it. 45 seconds for you oh, guys to get God. back where you were and I said, shut oh, up. Oh, what he said, 20, yeah, okay. See, I, I thought you were saying he said something just privately or something like he was talking smack or whatever but no what he just said i got you okay yeah yeah you welcome into the <laughs> <laughs> sorry what, oh, was, so, that's what so were good. you gonna say justin <laughs> you had i mean what are we not gonna use this i don't know this is gold oh it is no i yeah my pan was dry see this is this is why the soundboard was the it was nice you just start clicking stuff filler. No, what were you going to say though? Okay. Let's just let's just I just think we need a reset. I think we had some jitters there. I mean, you said just go with it. So, I don't even know. All right, you're right. I we should just go with it. What was your plan? Oh, I don't know. I thought you were going to okay. be like maybe make some sense and say like, "Hey, how's what's it, how's up guys? Been? Welcome back. It's been two and a half years since I've seen this guy." It's uh, not though. I saw last... you last week. On the podcast, we po okay, we haven't podcast. We haven't podcast. I didn't. I didn't even know you still did comedy. <laughs> See, this is, we used to have the wah 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 wah. That was a good one. That would have been a perfect. <laughs> the wah 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 wah. Right there, yeah. Wah wah wah. Dude, Phil, live soundboard. I love that. April twentieth, twenty. April twentieth, twenty twenty one. Four twenty was the last time. <laughs> That's did this podcast. for real. That was the guest. Wow. We called it the Three Amigos episode. No, there was another one. We no, there was all, another one. Marcus. Oh, all of us together. Yeah, we yeah really the last fat. one we were all together. Yeah. Yeah. What happened on that one? Uh, I, I vividly remember, but like, I'm just curious if, you, so guys, <laughs> if you remember Justin. There's good. Oh no, I've watched it a few times. We've I've the showed last all, one. I've showed all the guys your rant about uh, women. Oh, is oh, hold on, hold on. Two and three. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's called Midlife Crisis, and y'all did it on April 27th. No, <laughs> the last one. Yeah. Yeah. No, I mean since then. <laughs> You know, lots happened. I'm engaged. Look at that. See that? That's, yeah, congratulations. Thank you. Look at that. Congratulations, congratulations. dude. I thought we were going to call it like married men or something because now we're all in relationships. Everyone. All, yeah, I know, live with my girlfriend. Phil. He lives with his girlfriend. Tied down. We just hit two years yesterday. Tied down. You hit two years? We hit two years We used yesterday. to have the applause one, too. Yeah, crap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was so awesome. Yeah. No, my... Oh, yeah, also, Marcus is sober. That was I was sober last time though. It didn't seem that way. Okay. All right. The boom, anger was coming out. And the that. anger was coming out. The ang I I don't know if I got less angry when I quit drinking. That's not the point. Yeah. Congrats on two years, man. Thank when was you. that? Uh November 9th. Wow. It was nice. What'd you do? So she bought us a nice big ass couch, because uh, we needed it. So mm. I said, maybe let's think about it. And she goes, <laughs> I bought it. She, we had to get the deal because if we didn't buy it right away, we would have lost it, the forty percent deal. So we had. I to get, get that. I get. Yeah. That. So we bought the couch. So she bought that. I said, "Let's that be our anniversary gift," and she goes, "Yeah, we're not going to get gifts." And I go, "Okay." She goes, "I might get you a card." So then I got her a nice little purse. <laughs> you just completely ignored her. <laughs> no, but I because I didn't no want to come. <laughs> I didn't want to come empty-handed, dude. So I brought. I got her a purse. I got her a nice coffee mug that made her laugh, and then I wrote her a nice love note, and then. Uh, we went to a speakeasy, got some oh, nice cocktails. Wow. That's where she always wanted to go. So we went into a basement. <laughs> we went into a basement. Do it again. This is and, a, uh, this that's is what it smelled like was farts. This is, this is, it, where, where is the speakeasy? Uh, it was downtown on East uh, East East Sixth <laughs> by <laughs> by Lucky Duck. Oh, by um, Lucky! Oh, you guys were on that side of the street. Yeah, okay, it was. Wow. Uh, always it was. 
closer. But anyway, it was cool. It was in a basement. It was Mongolian themed, like 1850s. So the music was. <laughs> yeah, say that one. Say that again. What theme was it? Mongolian. Mongolian. My favorite country in Asia. I don't know if you know this, Justin, but I've become in the last couple of years a huge Mongolia enthusiast. Is that why we have this Mongolian night here? You know it's Mongolia, right? <laughs> Did you know that the whole time? No, you didn't. Dude, sometimes I can't Mongolia, say- that's where mangoes come from, right? <laughs> yeah. That tropic country of Mongolia where they, you know, they got winter 16 months out of the year and they're like, yeah, we'll grow mangoes in Mongolia. <laughs> Justin, this is... There's some words I can't say, man. I have speech... Mongolia? In- yeah, what is it called? How do you say it? Mongolia. Mongolia. You know the mongoose... Yeah, mongoose. <laughs> yeah, Mongolia. You got Mongolia. It. It's not that you can't. It's you don't know how. And I don't know, actually. You don't know. That's different than yeah. you can't. It's really like I just don't know a lot of things. That's why I'm glad you're Stephen back. Stephen Hawking didn't. It's not that he didn't know how to walk. He just couldn't. Yeah. You can. You I have can all your, walk. Yeah, you can do it. I can do this. So you took her to the, to the Mongolian grill. Yeah, we got we went to the Mongolian grill. The guy cooked us up some cocktails on the grill. Nice, dude. It was sick. You remember BD's Mongolian barbecue? Yeah, Michigan? dude, I love that place. We drove past that the other day. We were back in Michigan. I, I, t- like, I went on I went to that many of times. Yeah, it was great. It's great. You Dates. went to it so often you still don't know how to say Mongolian. That's great. You know, sometimes when you think about it and you're like you really don't know and you're gonna you feel like you're gonna sound stupid, but you gotta commit to saying it. I, I do that. Yeah, you knew. You, do, you yeah, didn't I, know. I didn't know the word, so it was like Mongolia. Two years. How long have you lived together, though? Like, I think over a year. Wow. I started. I I, I started uh, living with her while I still had my apartment. I had two places that I was paying for. It was retarded, but I didn't want to live with my roommate at the time. That, Who was that? Oh, some guy with an afro. Well, there's no "don't be racist" rule on here. <laughs> Yeah, we missed the whole don't be racist. Baby, I don't understand this. Obama sandwich. What is that? I don't know, honestly. That was a surprise. That should get us pulled. I feel I don't know what happened. Hey, do you have a a real soundboard on there? Are you just finding YouTube clips? There's no. (laughs) (laughs) That's all I got right Ah. now. Ah. (laughs) Punch sound. Nice. I don't I don't that, that's weird. That's going that I just going. broke I just broke like six rules. Dude, honestly, you know what's crazy? Two and a half years ago, two and a half years ago, I think I might have been having a heart attack for how this podcast is going. Why? But, I, but I'm having fun. I mean, other than using licensed music. I've grown up, I'm saying. Other than, you've grown up. Yeah, I've grown up a lot, dude. I living with a woman. Is it, was it that? Yeah. Is this the longest you've lived with a woman? I've never lived with a woman. I lived with one in L.A., but that was just another one of my roommates where we lived together. Remember Megan? I thought you were calling me a woman. Yeah, I remember Megan. I remember our roommate who almost <laughs> burned the house down. Did she? You don't remember that one time? <laughs> her oh, and her boyfriend know. were making deep fried Oreos, and then they just left the gas stove on. I you No, I, I wasn't just there. walked in the kitchen, I wasn't, I, and the, probably sto- gone. The, the gas is on like with flames and everything, and I'm like, hey, guys, they're there. I'm like... You gotta turn it off. I've not turned it off before, but like, man, you don't remember yeah, that dude. at all. No, I remember living in that house, wanting to kill myself every day because it was a fucking. That's where the time. podcast started. Sort That's of. where the podcast started. I remember because back when we started it there, I remember we would just smoke weed on it and yeah. drink vodka shots and beer. Yeah, and we would get we would be so trashed by the Aww. end of it. Oh, it was the best. You ever watched the early one? Yeah. The early ones are just like, what the, just what getting, were we? Just getting so drunk. We look like two homeless people trying to shoot a podcast with a phone we found on the trash. Now what do we look like? We, we look re- awesome. You look like you're in recovery. Recovery. Yeah. That, Let's call good? it rec- recovery. Is that good? Let's just name it after Eminem. Alex. Recovery? Yeah. You want to name it recovery? And, and then when this podcast fizzles out, we knew another one called Relapse. I like that. I don't know about that. I took a hundred Miggies before this. Oh, you did? Yeah. How, how, what? They feel, how are they feeling? How are you not sharing? Are y'all? <laughs> hey, we're going to Costco after this. I'm like, we're real, gonna right? like yeah, we're going you to didn't just make that Whoa, up. Whoa, we're going to Costco, dude. You know what's yeah, crazy? We should take some you know what's milligrams. crazy? That's where I'm at, bro. I almost, <laughs> I almost wear my wore my full Kirkland sweatsuit to the podcast. I thought that would be excessive, dude. Had I known we were going to Costco, I'd have worn the full Kirkland. 
We can buy one there. I'm not buying another Kirkland sweatsuit unless they have a different color. They have or a something. Kirkland sweatsuit. They did last year. It's seasonal. Everything there is seasonal. Okay, right? so what does it have like a Kirkland it's like curated? So it's it, their does, logo, right? The yeah. Kirkland signature across the sweatshirt, I and love then it. it's down. Then it's sweatpants, right? And it I just says it. the same thing down the sweat down the leg. That's sick. I wore it golfing the other day when when I played with Rob because I didn't. I don't have golf pants, so I was like, I gotta wear pants. It's too cold. And uh, the only pants I could think to wear was sweatpants. And I was like, dude, I should just wear all Kirkland, dude. Welcome to Costco. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, that's what the world is going to, for real. Idiocracy. Dude, Idiocracy, at, for yeah. real. Look at that. That's pretty pimp, dude. It just says, Kurt, you can't see it. Here, I'll, I'll hit play so you can see my full swing. Let me see here. I hit the green. Nice. Yeah, dude. But this is, I had to take the hoodie off because then it did get a little hot. <laughs> It, it wasn't like, a good looking. Yeah, swing. you looked like you fell forward there at the end. I did, yeah. So you know what sucks? <laughs> ah, first of all, ah. I parred that hole. Get the hell out of he here. He was dude. bending over very far. You should send that clip into the uh, the email. <laughs> what email? We got an email. Email us any of your clips about you golfing badly. Marcus is sending in the first <laughs> one. Let's go golfing. <laughs> <laughs> My point is. I have a Kirkland sweatsuit. That's sick, dude. I didn't say I was a good Do golfer. Do you still go there? I think that place is the devil. I think Costco is no. the devil. Every time you go there, you spend at least $200 on it low end. Me and Phil are going to go there and spend less than $40 right now. Bullshit. Yeah, Total. Yeah. I, Total. Hey, I guarantee I you don't. You got to have a plan. I'll, I'll bet money that you spend more than $40. You want to bet $40? I, because then I get free Costco. No, because if, like I, a no, me, if I bet $40, Marcus's Jew ass will fucking do that. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, dude. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What did it say? It whoa. Says, it says you cannot hate women, and you just you just did that. How do they do that? I said Jews. <laughs> oh, sorry. I was heard you. Yeah, my bad. Yeah. We didn't put Jews on the rules. That can't be good for the algorithm. Not right now. Probably not. Not right Shit. now. Yeah. Give it you a couple. You got a bleep. You can... got a bleep oh, sound hey. Speaking... See, Justin doesn't even know what's going on. He thinks <laughs> Mongolia is still at war with Russia. <laughs> he doesn't. Hey, listen to this. Do you know what's happening can in the I... Middle East? Which one? What part? The Middle East. Dumb Middle East? The. the. He said which one? He said which Middle East? <laughs> yeah. You know, I think the of Middle Mon East. Mongolia, I think it's like the Montana of the world. It's it like, is. What's going on? What's going on in Mongolia slash Montana, <laughs> dude? That's 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 the bit, dude. See, that's the 100 milligrams working right there. Dude. Yeah, it is. Do you have any more? Oh. No. I gave you that. I, that, that was, was the, the last, last of them. Thank you very much. So listen to this. <laughs> So listen to this. I don't even know why I'm on this podcast. So right listen now. to this. I mean, we got we got best friends over here, and then I'm we, just over we, here you, trying to show I, you my golf swing. If you I, wouldn't have I showed up 30 minutes late, there would have been an edible Ooh. for you. Uh, if I uh, if I did not live 30 minutes away, I would I could have left. So when did you later. leave? I left late. I'm late. I'm sorry. I'm late. Is that not a rule? I don't mind. Are you wearing contacts? No. Your right eye looks like it's kind of red. Oh, probably. But your left one looks fine. Did you yeah. take a Did you take a mean poop? Because you can't swear on the no, podcast. No, I took a nice one. I took <laughs> I a nice, it. friendly one. Here. This is Marcus in this morning. That Taco Bell. And his eyes just pop. <laughs> no, it was out that steak house. Oh, that one hurts me. I love their blooming onions, but I can't eat any of it. So I'll eat the blooming onion, and then I'll eat my steak. And by the time I finish the steak, my butthole goes, hello. And then I got to run to the bathroom, die, and then I go home and, and cry for a minute. Or an hour, actually. <laughs> yep. So that's how I feel. My stomach, my butthole feels I'm, like I'm your eye. I'm crying for your butthole right now. Yeah, my butthole looks like your eye. Red. <laughs> <laughs> you got a bamboo's ass eye, Marcus. <laughs> Marcus got a bamboo okay. ass eye. See this? It can't just be sound effect. And it can't just be fart sound effect. I started to make, no, I started to make music. <laughs> yeah, we got a new... No dude, dude, Phil, you are literally... You are the you are the kid from Bob's Burgers. Can you hear the farts? You are the kid, yeah, the little can. boy from Bob's Burgers right now. Uh, yeah. Who is the he, kid from you, Bob's you, you Burgers? You ever watch Bob's Burgers? I never kind of really. Are you did. saying what? that I have the capability to make a burger right now? Yeah. I would eat a burger. <laughs> Cause I could, this I'm I'm getting rocked right now. I ate that edible like 45 minutes ago on an empty stomach. Oh! Justin woke me up to come here, and now I'm yeah, just dude. I thought okay. Philip. I, I have a real Phillip question about this. It. Empty stomach. Is that good or bad? Because I've been told I don't like it. I've been told you're supposed to eat before you eat the edible. To I feel help like that work right now. That's it's what good. I've heard. 
Yeah. Right now it's I've good. heard you have to have the fat to help it work because yeah. I've eaten on empty stomachs. I don't know, man. I think my body's just fucked up with I messed up. You yeah. damn it. The most a gummy's ever worked for me was like after I ate a really I ate a gummy and then I ate a really fat Mexican meal. Yeah. After you ate the gummy. After I and I was like I have to go to I like took my clothes off and just rolled around in my bed for 5 hours without sleeping. That's yeah. What, what was the Mexican food? Was it that stuff in Round Rock? No, it was a. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I think it was like as simple as Taco Casa. I got like a chilada, okay. which is just, <laughs> which is just a piece. It's a bunch of ground beef wrapped in a big flour tortilla, Ooh, wow. and then it's just smothered in red gravy. So it's like a burrito. Oh, I don't no. want the red gravy on it though. <laughs> That's why you die. Yeah. You just eat the nah. beef. You need that gravy. What do you need that gravy? For? You like it moist? It's not a smothered burrito, then. You like it I moist? I like the green, the verde. Yeah. Mm. Oh, what, yeah, you yeah. want a dry Mexican meal? No. I feel like every Mexican dish is really just a, the, a reconstructed burrito. version of another Mexican dish. Honestly, <laughs> uh, so my... <laughs> The cooks yeah. in my back so we did. Had the taco, I work with. And then we had the burrito. So then we yeah. got the taco enchilada. wet and we wrapped it up. Yeah. That's an enchilada. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Then we, we dried it out a little bit, put it in a bigger tortilla. Dude. Taco. Burrito. Burrito. <laughs> we now, now, what's a what flauta? We opened it up. Oh, I'll get there. We opened up the burrito. We dumped it on chips. Nachos. 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 Flauta. We took. <laughs> we, we, t- we picked it back up with the nachos and we put it in a tortilla. And we dropped it in a deep fryer. Wow. That's a flauta. Flauta. That sounds really good. Right. But if you think about it, a flauta is kind of just, it's a crispy enchilada. Wow. <laughs> Phil, your people Ooh. are magical. It's, I will say. They I are don't think they're as magical as... Kitchen. We're doing I, a lot with very little. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, honestly, you are. They. I work... I'm sorry I gave you, <laughs> gave you, gave you a hard time about Mangolia because I didn't know anything about flautas. I didn't know that was just an yeah. enchilada, which is really just a taco, which is really... I don't even know what a taco it's is. It's really anymore. all a comes down to... A taco is a bent tostada. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's really a just a style. it's really just a tortilla and meat and then you have Mexican food. Well the way you make it. Yeah. No, I make good food. You remember my tacos in that California? I don't. <laughs> it was just meat. <laughs> <laughs> me and the oh yeah, dude. Marcus, I would go to Costco yeah, and I would right. buy forty tortillas. He wouldn't. He wouldn't flavor his meat like tacos either. He'd put all of his meat in a tortilla, but it would just be like beef. <laughs> just gray ground just, beef. Yeah, just gray ground beef. And he'd be like, "All right, guys." Yeah, I eat like twelve. He them. goes. He goes. All right, guys, come eat. You like slop and then throws it out. He eats. Tw- yeah, he eats twelve of them. <laughs> that place felt like a prison. Dude, he. It looked <laughs> like a prison too. It was a it square. Was a prison, the rooms were disgusting. The bathroom. That My though, room was nice, dude. When you moved out, did were you there when the kid moved in with the cat? No. Kid I was moved, gone. When the kid moved in with the cat and the kid moved in with the cat. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that kid. It's moved funny in to watch these edibles hit y'all differently. <laughs> ah, so the kid moved in with the cat. <laughs> just, just. And the, <laughs> Are you sure the cat didn't move in with the kid? <laughs> ah, yeah. You don't even know. Boots and cats. So the kid, boots and cats. And the kid moved in with the cat. And the kid moved in with the cat. Okay. And the cat moved in with the kid. And that put kid put a, a litter God. box in the in the in the bathroom. <laughs> and and he put it's a bathroom in a bathroom, <laughs> dude. That's so crazy, dude. It was a bathroom in a bathroom. So the fucking <laughs> god damn it. So the cat would track out the litter from the litter box through the bathroom, naturally through the to the living room to the kitchen, mm. everywhere else. And I started it started just accumulating from the litter box throughout the house. And I looked at the kid, and it went on for a week. And I said, hey. Would you mind cleaning up the litter? Because it's all over the house. Because the cat is what? I like clean up the litter. <laughs> I like clean up the litter is a great podcast. Can you clean up the litter? <laughs> Just lonely housewives kid, thinking it's about the cat the, it's like. To the house. To the, the cat. cat. To the, the room. To, to the living room. Else in the house. I've never, the cat I've never felt the more sober. Like, this is the go, worst. Go no, get that. No. Go get that. I want that. I'm sorry. This? <laughs> you can't get this anywhere else, buddy. I know. Yeah, because I you know what Costco, happened? Dude, I'm going to lose you in Costco like a parent, dude. <laughs> yeah. I'm hey. You know what you never hear in Costco? Hey, your mom's looking for you. Oh, trust me. You'll hear. This, this is me in Costco in about an hour. Is me. You're going to be looking at the rotisserie chickens is what we came for. Yeah. But I'm going to be in the self-driving vacuum. Say, I'm just, God help me, somebody. Look at his eye. <laughs> Look at his eyes. <laughs> 
I'm gonna get, that. Once I realize how tall the ceilings are in there, <laughs> I'm going to freak the fuck oh, out. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are tall ceilings. <laughs> no Did Wi-Fi, you... no, you don't get reception in a Costco, dude. It's like a casino. Right. Is it? No clocks. No clocks. Right. There, no, no, I swear to God, every Costco I go to, and I love Costco, I stand by this, but... Dude, you try to call your girl and be like, what did we actually need? The call does not go through, man. So now you're just, you're flying blind. <laughs> I hate when I want. fly blind. I hate when I fly blind because I can't see where I'm flying. I mean, Jess, what? <laughs> what? Oh. I'm picking up what he's putting down, dude. Yeah, he Dude, is. when Justin riffs, sometimes it's just getting into a roundabout and not taking an exit, dude. It's just, That's you right. are in a circle. And how do you feel at the end of it? Lost. Right? Here's Justin Lost, riffing. but I didn't go anywhere. Here's yeah. Justin riffing. Oh, look, there's Big Ben again. <laughs> I don't know if that's, that made any sense. That did to me. It did okay. to me. He doesn't know what Big Ben is. He thinks that's a quarterback It's in Mongolia. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you said Big Ben? I didn't even hear what he said. I just went with it. I don't think Justin hears a lot of what gets said. You know what? Maybe He's, re he's responding to like 20% of the stimuli of most people. That's dude. fucked up. Messed up. Sad. <laughs> <laughs> Give me three more words. Why are you talking you like it. Trump right now? It's messed up. It's sad. <laughs> it's really bad. Flying blind. I didn't like it. Um, also, it just kind of. I hurts. hate. It. Also, I hated it. Also, kind of. I didn't hated like it. it. I also hated it. Hurts my feelings. It hurts my. And it sucked. And it sucked. It was bad. What are we still talking about? I don't know. <laughs> All right. So. Um, I don't know how we got here. No, I know how we got here. Marcus, you... real quick, your shoes are melting. Watch out. I don't. I didn't get that one. Justin, you were the cat. You lost me. I there. was the cat who lived in the bathroom with the litter box. <laughs> Through the house, the kitchen, the living room, and everywhere. Else. Everywhere it went. Yeah, pop, pop, pop. Litter, 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 All right, litter. Guys. All right, Jesus Christ. This is a musical podcast, Marcus, and I know you're a rapper because you used to rap back in Detroit. That's why this is so painful. Because yeah. oh, I'm is listening it? to you oh, just is it? drop it. Let's oh, get him to freestyle. Well, man. then, then give me that to me. I'll put on a beat. Prove to me that you can. Illegal, uh, unlicensed, yeah, legal. Free, unlicensed There's one in there. Beat. Like a something type beat. You know what I mean? Here, here it is. Ready? That's how they get you. Yeah. Uh, wish I. Had the edible the that Justin had Then I mildly wouldn't feel so sad <laughs> What the hell am I rapping about? I don't know, I'm trying to get the fuck out of Ow. this Podcast so I can hit Costco with Phil's ass Get a little bit of chicken for that sunset it's strip Costco. Thing that we going Costco. to I don't even Costco. remember what the fuck is we Costco. going to Costco, baby Alright, that's Costco, baby <laughs> Oh, dude Dude, we're gonna you, Marcus. We're, I got the Costco flow. You don't even know when I'll be bringing that card. You go, oh no, cause oh. I'll be killing that shit every time I spit. Motherfucker, giving me samples of shit. I ain't finna buy, cause I'm too damn high, high. and I just wanna get up in the Costco line Costco. so I can check the fuck out. Realize check I out. don't have enough money to Yo, pull out. I got a yeah, coupon. I just spent another hundred fifty dollars. Yeah, gotta make a phone call and holler at Membership. my fucking bank, cause I think Membership. I'm fucking empty. Membership. Shit, I spent all my money on some Costco cheddar cheese. Gold membership card. <laughs> Gold membership card. What? Gold membership card. Yeah. Gold, Gold membership card. Yeah. Now I still uh. got that executive membership. Uh. Uh. Can't so afford classy. any of this shit. I honestly only got it for the gas prices. But now I'm out here buying all of these rices. So much rice I could feed an Asian village, motherfucker. Where did I be going and pillaging that fucking Costco every month, every day? It's every day. Shit, I don't even have enough yes, money Costco. for this. Yeah, Costco. <laughs> I got lost in there. I'm not gonna lie. I got good. really into it. Yeah, that was fun. Mm -hmm. That was fun. Yeah. It is a musical podcast. Y'all are back, dude. That's crazy. Y'all got that into was it. fun. <laughs> it started rough. <laughs> That's where we started, by the way. It was y'all were back. Y'all were doing this thing again. Oh yeah, back, back yeah. to the beginning. Yeah, that. back yeah. to it. Hey, it's speaking of how you been, man? Yeah, I'm alright. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm excited for Costco. Now. <laughs> I really am too. I'm gonna drop on 140. Told you. No. Told you. Phil, we I already won the bet, dude. You, you drop really, whatever you want. We really do have to go in there with a the plan, but you and I are going to walk out with a four-pack of golf clubs and a 30-pack of Kirkland golf balls. I just if they have golf balls, we're buying them. <laughs> we're splitting them. <laughs> Sorry, I'm going through something right now. Yeah. Phil's Puberty. Go Phil's going through it right now. Um, <laughs> oh. Welcome to the podcast with Justin Essenmacher. 
Hey guys, you can catch me next week doing Bundesliga while I'll talk about the soccer network. It's really fun. Um, that was an important podcast. I don't think you understand. When the whole sports world stopped, the Bundesliga was the first professional league to come back during COVID. Yeah, dude. He I did, had to let people know. You did save that one viewer. How do you, how do you spell that? <laughs> uh, it's it's uh, spell it with a B and a U <laughs> and an N no, and a no, D no. and an E and an S and an L to the I to the G to the A. You, yeah, come yeah. on now, kids. Says sing along. This is a s- singing word podcast. This is a children's podcast. This right? is for children. Yeah. <laughs> hey, kids. Kids, go tell your parents everything's going to be okay. You got Justin, Marcus, and Philip with you. Yeah, kids. How do you get a contact high from someone else's edible? That's what I'm trying to figure you out. You got to barf it up and eat it. And eat it good, Marcus. I I'm mean, s- we. This, I mean, one time I. At some him. point, he wanted more than twenty-five too, which is it, crazy to me. What, yeah, guess what hap- this Justin, just happened. It's working now. I think I'm having more fun. That's why it's working. But when I'm not, but when I'm by myself, it works different. It's not fun. Yeah. It's just more depressing. There's actually, a, there's You're a like track on the record patio of, smoking of of uh, of um, hemp products working better around y'all. Every time I, every time, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Honestly, I've done this podcast with y'all before, and I was Are these absolute, hemp edibles? No, I'm just being safe. Marcus was like my ent- my my gateway basically to get into the the Snoop Dogg style. I was with him. What, what does was, that mean, dude? We were it was blunts every morning. We woke up blunt. Means you should put that beard on top of your head and then make it cornrows. Oh, I always okay. You should have cornrows, dude. That'd be so sick. Hold on, first dude. Of all, leave the bulb first and then all, go cornrows on the side. First of all, give me my vape. And back, then get a right, and I then get a big ass gold BS chain, question. dude. Get a big ass gold chain so it has to go below your beard or cut it to where your beard is. I'm, I'm sorry. Touching my beard, dude. I'm sorry. Stop. <laughs> Marcus doesn't like being touched, dude. I forgot. You no, know you didn't. Marcus is a little bit of germaphobe. I know, dude. Yeah, he knows that. I know. But he you pee, know this. But he pees sitting down. That doesn't I make miss, any sense d- to me. Does he? That's a germaphobe thing. Is why it, would you put would your you ass sit on the germs? Am I going to ruin this for you now? No. Okay, cool. I'll rebuttal. Hey, what did you think of the bathroom in California? <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to talk about his bathroom here. Very nice. Uh, Cali bath. It's gross. No, because when you sit, when you stand to pee, yeah. you risk backsplash in your own toilet. You no, you don't. Back, you risk backsplash sitting down too, because it's right there. You're peeing right into it. Yeah. Or does your dick? Oh, you got a big dick. It hangs down. Good for you. Good for you. Mine's you got just a like direct, like just going. Bing! Yeah, I got so it's like bouncing off like that that thing at the festival, the fair. You know, with that game where you blow up the air balloon. I could do that easy. Yeah. I'm not hanging, just but I would say dart. like if this is 90 degrees and this yeah. is zero degrees, my shit's pretty much like I'm yeah, right snuffle off against because yeah. I'm a bigger guy. You, so you have a hard cock. When I got a turtleneck at all times. I'm not even circumcised. What's hold on? I mean, I am circumcised and I have a, like a, I have a turtleneck because I got a little bit of a hood, just, like not a hood, but yeah. like a little bit. Actually, so I've lost grower. a little bit of weight. You I hang a little bit now. But like when I was yeah, bigger, dude. Yeah, I'm talking dude, to guys who don't even have the same dick model as me. I'm like, a grower. How the fuck? I'm a grower, not a shower. It's not a grower, a grower shower too. thing. I, I thank God I'm not a. I thank God I'm a grower. You know what I mean? Because I would hate for my shit to be rubbing up against the inside of toilet bowls and stuff. Yeah, my dude, point. Well, yes. I, yeah, good, that's why I love it. You know? Yeah. yeah. I definitely don't. You guys don't even penis. know how to pee with a foreskin. So dude, what the even, fuck am I talking to you oh. guys about? Dude, that's yeah. Sucks. It's 2023. Who the fuck has to do that anymore? Yeah, that's uh, just like most a, of the world. <laughs> really? Most of the world. Well, most of the world want got that nasty dicks. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Mark Marcus is a clean guy. I eat. I eat off the foreskin. Marcus is a clean guy. Yeah, you would eat yeah. off the foreskin. <laughs> I eat off the inside of the fold, dude. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you call it a cheese board, if you will. <laughs> ah. Hey, Marcus, can I get that charcuterie? Ooh. 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 Stanky, <laughs> stanky, stanky. It's not stinky. I showered today. That's good. And yesterday. Hey, can I ask a question? The day before. Hey, can I ask a question? So you're sure. enga- so you're engaged, right? Sure. Yeah. You're planning to get married, to right? Yeah. Are you would you guys have a date? Oh, a date for the wedding? No, we don't have a date for the wedding. Okay. I thought you were gonna be like, Do you guys still go on dates? And I'm not, <laughs> I was like, I mean, we try. It's tough, dude. You gotta plan a date? Yeah, it you got to plan a date. It That's is tough so to plan. Tough, dude. Um, also, so we don't you, have a date for the wedding. No, okay, not at this time. You planning to have kids? Can I ask that? Is that too inappropriate? 
Is that not appropriate? Both of y'all have been in a relationship for a while now. Do both of y'all's girlfriends do the whole? When are we gonna go on a date? Things like we've been dating for oh. two years. We've been dating. <laughs> right. We've been dating for a Dude, long time. For saving it out of that other oh. question, he yeah. has. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. How's that go? I don't know. How's that go for you? Uh, yeah, dude. Honestly, I tell we talk about it all the time. We just we had we have talks about it all the time. Uh, October. Listen to this. October weekend one ACL three days. Weekend two, uh, we go to Michigan together. Uh, weekend three, we went down to Beaumont to do for a Halloween party. Uh-huh. Weekend four, we had to do uh, after the week after I had to do something else, and then we did something else did after you that. See him, did you see him literally buffer? Yeah, was it Worst Fest? No, we didn't do okay. Worst Fest, but we did. We did so many things, and it's like we we went on vacation, and then three days I came back, and I start doing things like get back into comedy, working. Yeah. She goes, I just think I haven't seen you that much, and I'm like, oh, I'm I'm talking to you right. Hey, I love women. <laughs> you gotta, Justin, you have to say, let's spend some time together. I do, and we had a big breakthrough, so I don't want to get mad about it. You had a breakthrough? We had a breakthrough, actually, after, like, uh, the two-year and stuff. We, what I was a, it? We, I, it just, I had a big talk, man. It's just, you, you had a big talk? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it's a just good like, breakthrough? Yeah, it's a good breakthrough. No, that's good. <laughs> that's <laughs> that's good. Breakthrough. It sounds like, it's I don't a good know. breakthrough. <laughs> that I think that was a, a positive thing for the relationship to have had, and I think it was kind of getting, you know, it just what wasn't was it getting, getting? Uh, getting it wasn't getting heard correctly, I guess. What? And what you wanted? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, that's but, good. But now she's hearing you. Yes. And I mean, it's just been a really but hard what, but this what year. Saying? This well, that's this year for us has been this year is has been the hardest year of my entire life. And yeah. I'm not like yeah. exaggerating it. And you've had a hard life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I'm right there with you, buddy. But I think what's most important that we're talking about now is that it's important that our our significant others never hang out with each other. Why? <laughs> or watch this. Yeah, that'd be terrible. Yeah, they don't watch. They, I don't think they should know that we know each other. What do you mean? Listen, my girlfriend. <laughs> so I just go into it too. She just ruined my fucking life, man. <laughs> just go into it. No, I mean, but honestly, I in my defense, Jordan knows like. I talk to her oh, about this her all name. the time. Name That's drop. crazy, dude. She, I talk. She's my like she entire set. Weird, this so. is her ass on my shirt. No, no, like, Justin you know? spells it weird, but he spells it wrong. Yeah, so. I, uh, yeah, I fuck it up all the time. Um, anyway, I'm the only one who said that for on the podcast. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're um, just you're not a clean comic. So, hey, Justin, can you work clean? Fucking no. Yeah, <laughs> I've done clean shows. I'm pretty clean. You've actually. done them. I'm pretty clean. No, I've gotten more mature. I think. Have you? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, calm down. <laughs> he had a big talk recently. Yeah, he had a big talk. I had a big talk. Big, big boy, talk. Big, big boy, boy talk. talk. I had a big boy talk with my girlfriend because we needed it as adults. And, and what did uh, you talk about, though? Like, what, what no, was honestly, the No, honestly, it's just, man? it was talking about, like, if not doing anything. Like, you just said that line. <laughs> and it's like, that's constantly happening. And it's like, it's a thing of, like, we can do as much as I can produce of money. I <laughs> I only have so much money, and so we do things, and I'm like, I want her to be happy, and I'll give as much as I can give, but at a point, it's like, we got to start, I got to, like, save, so if, like, we want to move, if something happens to <laughs> us, like, yeah. I, we need, like... If the coastline starts to erode like, yeah, towards dude, Austin, we might have like, to move to Colorado, yeah, honey. Yeah, it's just a lot of calming <laughs> down, dude, because, like, we are doing a lot of stuff, yeah. and we're yeah. spending, even if we're not doing stuff, we're still spending money. Just yeah. to fill in the void of not doing something. So it's like, let's get Uber Eats. Let's not. That, you know, hey, like, we, we Uber Eats the Outback Steakhouse last night. Oh. And I don't mind it, but it, <laughs> when it's a lot, dude, it's just, it, it turns into a lot and it's just. We split it. it. Get, we split it, though. We split it, too. But I yeah, also. I'm splitting just, things, too. But I'm also like, we could cook. I could cook you a great meal. We have all this food that we just bought. Or what happens is I end up buying the Outback Steakhouse uh, Uber Eats. In the next day, I'll be like, I got this. You got the next one? She's like, yeah, where are we going for lunch today? She's like, in and out. I'm like, I bet the fuck we are going. Yeah, we are. Yeah, in and out, baby. That sounds good. Also, you know what? I've realized. You got to get ahead of that. You got to split. Hey, you know what? <laughs> you got to split. You don't, you don't, you don't take, you don't take, you don't kick the ball in overtime. Right. You got to send your girlfriend you the memo. You do not kick the ball in overtime. You take yeah. the ball. <laughs> yeah. You got to send her the memo request before the food even gets there. Yeah. You got, and then when it gets there, she hasn't sent it yet. You leave that shit on the front door. Yeah. You do not uh, Uber canceled it I don't know And then when she goes to bed finally You sneak mm-hmm. out at night 
and you eat two all helpings of, of ribs and steaks to you yourself. You eat the whole thing yeah. cold? Yeah, in the laundry room. Yeah. Ah! You close the doors behind you, and you eat $74 worth of Outback that would have yeah. only cost you $48 to go yeah. eat <laughs> if you yes. went in person. Yeah, and it's it cold. All. That's the thing oh. I get mad. I about. think that's called being a man. Yeah, yeah, being that's a man. Being a man. No, I can't do it. She, uh, she, yeah, no, I'm not gonna yeah. do that. I'm not. I don't even that. want this last racket. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I'm definitely not gonna but I do paid that. For it, no, no way. You know what really sucked is like we ate so much food in Michigan, like my mom's food, uh, her dad's food. We ate <laughs> like the, at the show, both shows. They yeah. had so much food. So and and everywhere we went, everyone's like, "Well, take take food home, take food home." To, and it's like, "Well, we can't take it on the plane." Yeah, no. So you end up at your mom's house the night before the flight with like sixteen meals, and you got an eight a.m. flight, and you're like, "I mean, I'm gonna try to eat as much." You and then, would. I knew it was. You try go, to eat as eat much a- as you can, and then you get back home and you have nothing at home, and you're just sitting there like, "Dude, we had like so much food twelve hours ago." Yeah. And it's now twelve hundred miles away. Yeah, welcome to adulthood, Marcus. So then we ordered Outback. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that and that's the what point. you do. And then it, your brain's like, yeah, I'm so mad. I'm going to order Outback and it'll make it better. The thing that makes you mad, like we ordered pho the other day. And it's like you when it gets. You can't say that, dude. It's, not, it's the rules. It, what, what is it? Pho? <laughs> They quit fudding around. All right, I'll yeah. fu- I'll stop fudding around. The fu- so we ordered pho, and when it gets there, it's like cold. So then you have to reheat everything. We put all in the air fryer, so it's like you, you air fried it. pho. No, it's like you get the crab rangoons, you get the egg rolls, <laughs> you get the fried so rice. You didn't even cool. get pho. You just got she Panda gets, Express. She gets pho. I don't like pho. I don't want pho. Yeah. I don't <laughs> want pho. Uh, I don't fuck. like it's like it's just big soup. Yeah, it's just big soup. I don't like I don't know either. what it is. What can you tell women me? Women love fuck. Why do women love soup so much? I just love soup season. I just don't get soup excited. Is, soup is great. But it's like, great, but fuh I don't sucks. pick it. You're eating pho. Like pho is the size of like a, a spare tire. It <laughs> it's huge, yeah. Pretty much. They bring it out. She does <laughs> it gives me a bu- she gets a bucket of water to pour in the steak. And it's pho. And she gets it and she gets the she gets rare meat, like it's raw. Mm-hmm. So she mm. She has to put all the stuff in the box. I go, that just pisses me off. The meal's like however much dollars it is, $20, and then you get it, and then you have to make it. <laughs> and they're like, and girls get excited for it, and they're like, yeah, I love it. It's just raw meat, and then you put water on it, and you're like, and you got to microwave the water. So then you got to you gotta cook the steak in the microwave. I, I hate it. It's like cosplay cooking. It is. I don't know why You're not women... not actually cooking this. I think you know women that, just right? like complicated things, maybe. Maybe that's it. That's why they love you? Oh, or... you just go to the restaurant, and then they give you all the stuff, and you cook it yourself, and it's really fun. It's just a good experience. Can I... Can they just oh, do this it? This talk you had with your girl would have been fantastic to just eavesdrop on, just like, kind of like, what are they talking about? Hey, you don't understand, babe. The whole fuck thing is really getting to me. <laughs> <laughs> It's that. like you cook there, you cook I, here, you cook three I, more times. I'll order something meal. else. No, it's not because you're gonna get pho, and I know you're gonna get pho, and you know you're gonna get. Pho. I don't pho, mind her getting pho. I get what I like. Justin is I, going to a nice Vietnamese restaurant for pho with his girlfriend, and he's you can't order chicken tenders at a pho restaurant. Right. He found so the damn near closest thing. He's like, fried right, thing. I need crab rangoons, fried rice, <laughs> and what else do you get? Teriyaki chicken on a stick. Fri- fried rice. <laughs> my guy, my, my guy orders the mall, the mall. Mall food court special. Yeah, and hey. you know, you know, the Asian server has to go back and tell the Mexican cooks that they they have a child out here. Now. <laughs> Guys, this is Uber Eats. It's a fun place. You are changing the story to oh, make you me sound Ubered stupid. Pho? Yeah, that's what. She, yeah. I miss that. That's a nightmare. That's why I said Uber Eats pho. That was the whole point of I got to reheat the food and shit. But there's also restaurants where I got to go and cook. They my They send food. you the bucket of broth. Yeah, yeah. you get oh, a bucket yeah, you of never broth. Never ordered pho. Not hot. Not oh. hot. You get a bucket of broth. And then you get a raw meat. That's how you're supposed to do it. Yeah. And then because the water cooks the broth, I mean the beef, and then you eat it. It's so good. Yummy. Yo, that's wild. And then she adds it. It takes her about 20 minutes to set up her pho till she gets to eat it. And I'm you like, know what's funny? I'm done eating by the time she starts eating. You know what's funny? We're basically three white dudes dating three completely different women, and we yeah. all have oh, the yeah. same thing. Yeah. yeah. Literally. The so, pho! The pho! Yeah. That's a good name, the pho, for our podcast. No, because then people no. are going to think it's pho related. I yeah. don't want to I mean, talk it can about, be. I don't want to talk <laughs> about pho. It probably pho. will be. <laughs> We're going to order pho tonight, probably. 
Fu doesn't sound bad, honestly. Because why the f nah? Not, Not when we go to Costco. Once we're at Costco, we're gonna be like, dude. Wait, so fu, you, what are you guys? You guys are going to Costco yeah. tonight because you're going to a party tonight. We have a uh, the sunset Starts in strip. One minute, actually. <laughs> oh, we're gonna be late. Yeah. Are you kidding How me? How long does it last? I don't know. I don't know. A it's day. A, it's a. It's a it's a staff friends giving at the Sunset Strip, so it's just you know me, Phil, and the people who get paid from that place, and our significant others, and uh, and significant. You just said friends. I'm sitting next to you on a couch. Whatever. Next week is the friends friends. Everyone can come to the one next week. It's a oh, chili then it's the friends friends. I didn't friends. make this damn schedule. Don't oh, get mad yeah, at then me. Let me guess. Next week is the friends 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 ones. No, next. Then it's the actual. What is this, Doctor Seuss? <laughs> Hey guys, come to the party. You can bring your friends and this friends, 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 Justin, friends, friends. This is why people don't invite you to stuff. That <gasps> hurts, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that hurts. <laughs> Welcome to the Justin's in Pain podcast. Dude, there we go. Justin. That was. I mean, you nailed on head. I mean, they did just come into the house and they go, "Hey, oh. yeah, dude, we keep golfing every day. We go. I've asked them." Multiple times to go golfing. Have you ever got a text to go golfing? You've no. never texted me about golf. I have talked to you guys in person about it, and multiple then you never times. follow up. Oh, I I don't know when you're going golfing because you don't follow up. It's like a business meeting, and not, not like in oh. a real way. Like golfing is like it's because if you say it. I meet at nine, and then one guy shows up at nine o five, it's so out of whack. So it's like it not. I'm not saying that you will show up at nine. It's like. It's that amount of planning to go golfing. I so go, if you golfing, do go guys, golfing, guys. I've been golfing many of times. I know how to go. golf. Well, then let's go. You also have to use my clubs. Yeah. So you can only go Here, golfing. I'll with add them to the group so you chat. you have to text me. I'll add them to the group chat right Stop now. Stop touching hey, But you got to behave. What are you guys talking? I go you golfing. Behave I am a man. You got to behave in the group chat. The group chat's Anthony. Yeah, in the Anthony group pick, chat. He'll in kick you out. Chat. I don't even like group chat. I would just get the information. This is why you haven't come golfing. That's why you haven't come you don't like group chats. You don't hit me up about it. You're left-handed, and I'm the only <gasps> left-handed golfer. Yeah, He's a you lefty have to go too. with him. You have to go with me. Allie has left-handed clubs. Ooh, I know. Fuck! I said her name too. Yeah, <laughs> idiots. Yeah, dude. Because you told me. That means yeah, I win. Allie has left-handed clubs. Podcast, right? Yeah. Who? What's your wife's name? You'll never know. I'll just say it. Don't. Do you, do you not say her name? What? Do you not say her name? The We're, name. The name house should not be spoken. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I. I can say her name. It doesn't matter. She's a. She's. Yeah, she's a musician. I say your name. I don't mind it. If they want to, if they want to, if they want to rewind thirty-seven seconds and do a deep dive into my life, yeah, just Mark, on my Instagram. You know how easy yeah. it would be to figure mine yeah. out. Yeah. What, why is it so easy to figure out who's yours? Because she's well known. Like uh, we'll walk down the street and people will be like, "Oh my god, I saw you opening for blah blah blah." Yeah, but they don't know you're dating her. I don't. They don't need to know that. So what how would they, they know? know so how for? would they know she's your girlfriend? Because we're holding hands, dipshit. <laughs> She could just be holding your hand. <laughs> yeah, in Mongolia, right? Where yeah, people just hold Mangolia, hands randomly. Where they cook food right in front of you. Marcus holds hands there. That's all you do is hold hands? <laughs> on the street? Yeah, we don't fuck on the street. You don't, you don't have sex? On the street? No. Where do you have sex? At home. In a tree. <laughs> oh, God. In a tree by the bay. I saw an elephant the other day. So is Eminem that your wasn't favorite? Rap. Hey, that is Eminem was... your favorite artist? What is Eminem your favorite artist? Yeah. What? All right. Should I add Justin to the group chat or no? Yeah, add him to the group chat. <laughs> but Warren, we're warning you, and we're going to warn the group chat. We're going to say Justin is highly volatile. All right. There's some. Hey, is this what people think about me? There's some. There's some. No, this is who you are. <laughs> what do you mean think about? There's facts and there's thoughts. My father-in-law's in this chat. My future father-in-law's in this chat. I need you to behave in this. He's chat. in it. <laughs> I was like, "Wait, I need to behave." I need you. I need you to. I need you to be right. You guys, I'll behave. Thank I was you. Like, wait, I just want to go wait, golf. Tony sometime. is Allie's dad. What? <laughs> Dude, come golfing. Let's play golf this week. Is it going to be shitty this week? I when do you guys know. go golfing, though? Okay. At Hancock, it's eighteen dollars. When? In the morning, probably. It's going to be beautiful this week. Let's go play. We'll Let's go, to go play. We'll go to Butler first. So I can yeah, play. yeah, yeah. He's hurt, so he can't play the big court, the big boy course. But let's play the little one. Let's play the little. It's super fun. I've only played it once, but it's I would fun. love to do that. If I can go, I can go. I usually work. This is what this is what George <laughs> is talking about. <laughs> this, is what she's, yeah. this is what the fuck she's talking about, dude. Sorry, I said the fuck. I stopped it. I, I, bad. I've said shit a couple times. It's okay. You've eaten shit too a couple yeah. times <laughs> on the golf course. Yeah. yeah. Um, 
Justin, you know, you can come, but if you're working and you don't hit people up and you don't have clubs and you're left handed, <laughs> so you can't even use anyone's clubs but mine, what do you want us to do? The only place you could go is Butler. They rent clubs out for a dollar a piece. You only need two. Oh yeah, yeah. So could. a total will spend like twenty bucks there. Well, we got to play Butler anyway. I'm I'm down to do like a two week Butler binge. Then we do the short course, yeah. and then we get back at it in a month. I think I got it. You think you? In a month. You might maybe you should switch to left handed. No, that's my lead. That would be my. Oh. Lead oh yeah. Sick. Thank you guys. You're gonna. You're just gonna. You're gonna what? You're gonna be weird about it now. I just said thank you. I just added you to the group chat. I just said thank you're you. You're in the group chat. You're in the I group literally chat. just said thank you. You better send a meme. Thank you Quick. to my friends. It's a meme-based golf group chat where we also organize. Tony Hinch together. in it. No, he's pending. He's pending? And yeah. cut that. <laughs> Phil! Shit, sorry. I mean, this has been a fun podcast. Uh, <laughs> and, I'll be honest. I've had fun. I hope I'll be honest. Again. Did you not have fun? Did you really time. not have fun? Okay, because you look upset now. <laughs> are, you that's now are you caught up about the golf thing still? It's been like 15 seconds. Are you guys doing that? Are you guys messing with me? Or what are we doing? We're trying to have big Are you golf. upset about that you haven't played golf yet in Austin? Are you upset about that? No. That's a lie. His eyes <laughs> wandered when he said it. I, I know. I know it's a lie. They didn't wander. <laughs> Dude, Wednesday. What, Wednesday. 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 Are you working Wednesday? Wednesday? Yeah, I am. Are you working Tuesday? I am. What time? Thursday. Yeah, I am. Friday. It work. Saturday. It work. What time? Damn. In the morning. Hey, Phil, why don't we ever take Justin golfing? Shit. I don't get it. I'll, I'll, I'll switch we my never days. Had this hey, I'll out. switch my days and I'll get a day off. I want to go golfing. The real question is, why do we have so much time to golf? <laughs> yeah, honestly, what the hell? Do we you work at night. Say? We work at night. We I work was, at night. I'm actually available to work all. The, I'm actually available to play golf all. Every one of them. I can <laughs> golf after. I can golf after work. That's when we go to work. Your schedule's off. This is like this is like the Jordan thing all go, over again. Go, where it's go, literally like we in, don't spend. Any I can time go golf together. on Monday. Yeah, before we podcast. Yeah, let's play on Monday, and then we come in and we podcast. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. That's little, a great idea. A Bonding. Short, little short nine holes. We don't talk much out there because we'll burn through content. That's we're, gonna, true. we're focused out there. Yeah, so we don't talk at all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is true. So Monday. So Monday. Monday works. Monday we works. We can play golf with you on Monday. I would love that. What okay. time, guys? What's set of time right now? That's how it works. Or we're we gonna come back here at one. Let's say ten. 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 Yep. One. Okay. Ten thirty. Ten. Does that work for you, Justin? Yeah. It does. I'm happy. Are you still going through it? Yes. I'm always going through something, dude. Come on. When aren't we? Are you not going through anything? Oh, I'm going through tons of stuff. But I, I have this ability that most adults have to be able to compartmentalize when they share certain feelings and with whom they share them. Oh. And then, you know, act adult otherwise. Oh. You're just always emotional, bro. I don't think he's saying that you don't have that ability at all. I just think he's saying that he has that ability. And that's yeah. why I I'm here. exercise that ability. Yeah. I think you have it, too. Just like you know how to say Mongolia. Yeah. You don't, though. Yeah. You, you don't got, do you got, you got a lot of anger inside you? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all are like spy versus spy. Go. Yeah. It's honestly like, yeah, he has anger inside him. He's like, well, you just take him, you just shove it down and you don't talk about no, it. No, because no, because my therapist has been down. saying I can't do that anymore. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, no wonder yeah. shit. You got yeah. You take the frustration and you grab a golf club. Yes. Yeah. And then you and swing you beat through. beat her in the. Whoa. Uh, in, whoa. In whoa. golf. You beat him in golf. Whoa. Justin, him. oh my God! I said you beat him in golf. You didn't let me finish, guys. You just rushed to conclusions. You woman. <laughs> no, you no. said women. You yeah. said a thing. You women. You said a whole thing. I'm calling a wellness check. What do you guys hours. even? Do you guys want? Do you guys want to ask me? Do you want to? You want to me to answer your questions, or are you gonna answer them for me? I feel like the, the golf thing really peeled a scab I off know. or something. Yeah. <laughs> There's always something. There's always something that. There's always layers. Was it that or the pho? Was it the was golf it? or the pho? I've, we was stacked. The... We stacked too hard on him. We, yeah. we we put too many plates in his hand at the same time. You did. And they yeah, get heavy. Yeah, but you took every They plate. get heavy. That's right. Every time. They get heavy. He's a nice guy. But you t uh, Yeah, thank you. Justin. That's why I do it. No, no, no. But and this honestly, is this is... Do. I'll tell you this. Uh, speaking of doing that, that's honestly what happens at my job. As soon as I pick up all of the plates You're off the table... You're a server? Yeah, I, yeah. So you hold plates? So I, I, I pick up all the plates off the table. I go like this. I go like this. <laughs> 
eight. Got to talk in the mic. I have eight ta- plates on my on my arms like this, and then they go like this. They go, "Hey, so how's your how's your day going? What's your story? Tell us everything about yourself." And and I have all these eight plates in my hand, and I'm so nice. I sit there and I go. Yeah, I'm from Michigan. So it's a metaphor for life. Yeah, dude. And I'm carrying those plates and I'm worn out, dude. I'm I'm sore. I'm torn and I'm sore. <laughs> and I'm jaded. I'm <laughs> <laughs> I'm jaded would be great. Just the I'm jaded podcast. I'm, yeah, I'm jaded Pinka Smith. I'm uh, jaded Pinka Smith. I'm jaded. I'm jaded Pinkett Smith, right? Pinkett. Pinkett. JJ, is there a point of this where we're, you wanted us to do well, names? Well, yeah, I think I, it, no, so the, the, this is going to be episode zero. 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 What does that mean? That means next. That means next episode we actually start to talk. What is okay? So, but, but well, this. Probably, probably still this, this yeah, round if zero. we don't release this, I'm gonna. I'm never taking you golfing. No, there are some really. There are some really good ones. But Marcus, <laughs> has, have you done any podcasting since your podcast? Not my own. When did you end? What was your last one? A porn and capitalism. That was it. Yeah, you almost said porn right too. <laughs> Born and capital. I forgot what it was. Bjorn. I always, I always scroll up on Bjorn my. and capitalism. I scroll up on my airdrop on my, I mean my iCloud for pictures and videos. Sure. And I always scroll past these porn stars because you Marcus haven't deleted those equipment. pictures. I no, know why you're in a fight ago. with your girlfriend. It's iCloud shit that's like three Could years easily old. Easily be deleted. And it's. <laughs> I've deleted that. We should all delete it. Yeah, but you. <laughs> all right. Anyway. Uh, I mean, I think. So you stop porn and cap. What happened with porn and capitalism? I got sick of it. Why would you get sick of it? I, lo- I thought I you loved. I thought you were it. addicted to porn and capitalism. <laughs> Phil, fuck you, Phil. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, was that a roundabout too? You. Was that a what? You fa. Oh, dude. See how I just Whoa. take it. You gotta take Whoa. it. Whoa. You gotta reflect. You gotta bounce back. You gotta keep that. Smile what if on we your call? Face. What if we call the podcast? Bounce y'all back? call the podcast personal growth. <laughs> I like that. Growing pains. That's already a That's, show. Is it? Oh, hear me out. Two and a half men. All in the fan. <laughs> I thought about two and a half men. Honestly. <laughs> what are you then? Are you the half? Here we. <laughs> are you the half? Who's the half? I'm not the fucking half. I'm the half. How are you the half? Because I'm like half here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You want to be called uh, two ge- two German ge- two Germans and a Mexican? Do you want to call it that? I like it. It's We're Germans wor- and he's a, bit a of Mexican. A mouthful. <laughs> T- two ger one mex. <laughs> Could sort it down a little bit. Two yeah. Ger- two ger one mex. Ger Mexicans. Two Germans mm. and a. Two Germans in and they again. What a <laughs> they do a L podcast. L podcast. La podcasta. La podcast. Eh, Justin, you had a good time. You had a good time. I had good I had, time. Had you a, having good time, Justin? Had, 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 had good time. In traditional fashion, y'all save y'all save the uh, <laughs> the accent. Wasn't a rule. Unit. Oh, you live can't do from, a Mexican accent? Live from New York. I can't do a live accent. I mean, a live a Mexican accent. <laughs> <laughs> I can't fool. do a Mexican accent good. I Say can't. Fool, you can not do whatever you put and your I mind work. to. Yo. Yo, I can do that, Holmes, but I can't do it. golfing. Thanks, way. It's a good thing. Gracias, way. We know the greatest keeper. Hey, you gringo. <laughs> whoa. Is he that? Whoa. All right. We're going to name the podcast. He's white. They have gringo stuff on meal menus. I don't like. That's how they get back at us. No, they give you a different menu. <laughs> they get back at us. They put gringo taco on there. All right. Well, thank you guys for watching. Uh, thank you guys for watching right? the two Germans and one Mexican. No. 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 We're not putting that out like that. It's. Not, it's you didn't like that name? No. Okay. Try yours. I didn't with, come up with you one. say all right. You say I'm a send jaded. Off. All right, you say a send off. Thank you for watching another episode of Jaded. No, I don't like it. Thank uh, you for watching two Germans and a Mexican. I don't like that either. <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> thanks for watching. I'm jaded, and I'm going to Costco. Uh, <laughs> Did that work? I'll, we'll talk about it. I mean, and thanks for watching. Travel, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody. 
Thanks for watching this episode of Growing Pains. No, maybe no. Th- hey, thanks. Hey, everybody. Thanks for personal watching this growth. episode of Personal, personal growth. growth. Personal growth with your three favorite friends. Where you can grow. Hey, speaking of personal growth, look at this fucking thing. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs>